Does anyone notice that the weather is like really fucking weird? Uh -huh. It seems to me like they really fucked up the weather pattern with the spraying shit that they're doing off the coast because that's confirmed. They don't, it's like that's not conspiracy shit at all. Uh, they're like cloud seeding off like the East Coast. What's up, Stacy? You know, I think it's really fucked our weather patterns to the point where it's like, what? Pretty messed. So I think there should be a counter every day now uh, that Bibi Netanyahu isn't uh, put in jail since that beheaded uh, baby. I, I think we should do that. We should have a count every day that the ICC doesn't issue a warrant for his arrest. Because we might not be posting on it right now, but this shit is still going on. They like to do internet blackouts too in Gaza so that people can't upload their shit. So... You know, you might get a, I don't know. I haven't really scrolled through anything on Instagram. I don't know if it's still pouring out like it was. But nothing's changed with that. We're still fund. we're still helping fund genocide. It's all the same still. You just have to learn to live in your country knowing it's, you know, war criminals. You know. But uh, if you want to, if you want to put a little coinage in our in our uh, financials, it's in our description. If you want to drop a, a couple pennies or two, you know. Like I know Yoshi, Yoshi's usually throw a buck in there, and like here's a dollar, you know, Yoshi bucks. Uh, but if you want to put anything in there, that'd be cool. I mean, I mean, I'm called an eat bigger, so I got to like live that, you know, you got to live your expectations. And that's what I'm trying to do. But anyway, uh, saw something pretty interesting on the Y files about the moon. Can you tell me how NASA managed to destroy the original masters of the moon landing footage? Could somebody tell me how that's possible? That's such an important thing in history that took place that they, oh, we destroyed the masters. You also say, NASA, that we lost the technology. We no longer have the technology that got us to the moon. Are you, do you think we're like to the public? Oh, they said it. It must be true. I mean, why, why would they lie about that? Like the system thinks we're so fucking stupid, man. I mean, there's plenty of simple people out there, myself included, but we're not that dumb. We're not that fucking stupid. You can't tell us that there's a, a steak on the plate in front of us and it's dog shit. Some of us aren't like that. Okay? That's why you have your problems trying to push some of this New World Order bullshit through because some of us go, no, that's bullshit. And just that is a threat to the system. Just that. Just somebody going, nope, that's bullshit. That's a threat. Isn't that crazy? You're not comatose. So you're a threat to the system. Well, that well, that's definitely telling you something. That's a predatory dog shit system. Yeah.
and we have capitalism and we say it, we're, we're, it's capitalism and uh, we have a democracy so we're better than the world and we can export all of this shit to the world because we did it the best. I mean, you could tell yourself that. You could tell yourself that this is the most humane no cage prison that's been created for humanity. You could claim that. I think the natives probably did it way better. And it wasn't even a prison in that case. That's freedom. Native culture. Live on the land, trade, and everybody gets along and we have a powwow every now and then and have a meal together. That sounds pretty good. You know? Who needs a... Uh, who needs food stamps if you have local natives that, that plant all their own food and you could just go and get a few cobs of corn from, from your neighbor? That's pretty cool, ain't it? Yeah, that's why the white man wanted to kill that off. And, that, and now we're living in an era where the, the fucking government pays farmers not to farm. Oh, I have a, I have a homestead. I have a farmstead. We'll pay you $4,000 a, a month to not plant. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll take that, but why? That's not for you to, don't worry about that. We just don't need more in the supply right now because we're playing the, the cards of we're going to starve people. We won't tell the farmer that, but that's why they're doing it. We need a little bit of scarcity of food, so let's just let's 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 just hold off on the farming for a little bit. And now your dollar is is going how five dollars a loaf of bread? No, maybe not that bad. Three fifty. Let's say two forty nine. Yeah, that's your cheapest loaf of bread now. You get two for a buck back in the day. Two for a buck. Buy one, get one free. White bread. 99 cents. Hell yeah. I'm old enough to remember that. Anyway. <laughs> the bullshit continues. And DoorDash is telling me get something. Yeah, I don't got no money for no DoorDash. I'm eating toasted bread in the oven with uh, uh, maple syrup on it. Syrup toast. God, I wish I could get... I, I make too much for stamps, but make enough to actually feed everyone and cover all the... Yeah, exactly. That's I think they should. that should be provided to everyone anyway, Krista. Like a minimum income deal. Elon Musk, what people hate the guy, whatever. I don't give a shit. Like, he's not dumb. He said, it's time. You got to do that. Bernie Sanders, too. Whatever you think of Bernie. He, like, we need, we need everybody getting a certain amount of money. And I think it should be that way. Like, why not? At, why not? Because we give too much money to bomb is Palestine? We're... We're given thirty billion to Palestine to bomb it to Israel to bomb Palestine. Why not? Why can't we feed people with that money? No, we got to blow apart brown people. That's what that the whole deal is. Global empire blow apart brown babies. We can't feed people. Like why are we going to do that? That's ridiculous. Another video, shout out to the Y Files because it's an awesome channel. They say, uh, you know, Club of Rome. They had a deal. We're gonna so we're gonna break. We're literally gonna take the the setup that's in Revelation, and that's gonna be our plan. And we have to get rid of two thirds of the planet, like it says in Revelation. At ten regions, right? The ten horned beast, and then the little horn comes up from the ten, who's the who's the man of sin, proclaims himself God over all things. 
Club of Rome's got their deal. For sure. And they're like, their deal is, well, we got a planet. We have limited resources. So the best thing that we could do in the future is uh, depopulate the planet. I just went grocery shopping and spent over $160 for 10 items. Thanks, Walmart. That's insane, Emily. Every month is a uh, juggling act to make sure everyone is good and make sure necessities get paid. Yeah, bless you, Krista, and I hope it gets better, you know? I really hope it gets better. But, I mean, this president could do something. He could say to the Fed, look, you got to make the dollar worth more because you got to go to the Fed for that. You can't go to the fucking Treasury like you're supposed to under the Constitution. You can't do that. We got to go to the fucking Fed that uh, controls our rate on the dollar when the people that own the, uh, the, the ownership on the board on the Fed is all foreigners. Wow. Isn't that incredible? You think they have your best interests at heart? I don't. The U.S. Treasury, they'd have your interest at heart. And monetary policy set by the Congress. Oh, shit, our Congress, you want them dealing with that? No, I guess not. Maybe it's better with the Fed. You have Marjorie Taylor Greene deciding the value of your currency. Oh, what's Marge know about monetary policy? I don't know. You should ask her. Miss Green, what is your position on the Fed? Laura, Lauren, Miss, yeah, Miss Bobert, what is your take on the Federal Reserve? If I was the reporter, I'd just say, hey, hand job. What do you think of the Fed? And then she'd go, how rude. And I'd go, yeah, I'm sorry, that wasn't appropriate. Congresswoman Bobert, what's your opinion on the Fed? Huh? Let's hear it. Fuck me. These people in Congress, are you serious? Matt Gates, Mr. Gates, gentlemen, sir. <laughs> Scum. Uh, what's your take on the Fed? Are you a good Zionist? Are you good? Are you good Zionist? You're going to say you love the Fed if you're a good Zionist because it's always Kazar G Kazars at the head of the Fed. You ever notice that? Alan Greenspan. Yeah. Kazars at the head of the Fed all the time. Paul Volcker. Huh? Janet Yellen. Kazars. All of them. Why? That's pretty weird, ain't it? No, it's not weird. The Nazis won the war. You wonder why there's not a republic anymore because the Nazis won and they, instead of giving us a totalitarian dictatorship with, with Hitler, they gave us a democracy. See? See? It's not a free republic. It's not a representative republic, which is what we were taught in school, the form of government we have. No, it's a democratic republic. What the fuck is a democratic republic? That's a pet. That's an opposite. You either have a democracy or a republic. You can have a representative republic, which is what we were supposed to have. Oh my God, it's so hot. Even up with the AC running full blast, my house is up to 80 inside. That's horrible, Krista. How would I fix it? Rebecca, you want to know? It's real easy. It's pretty simple. Really. You abolish the Federal Reserve System in the United States. The Federal Reserve banking system is foreign. It's not. It has nothing to do with our interests as a people. And very much more smarter people than me said that if you give me the control of a nation's currency, I care not what laws it makes. You know who said that? One of the kings of the earth, Rothschilds. Oh, 
Jews? Nope, wrong. Synagogue of Satan. Khazar, Germans. Oh. Khazars again? Yeah, Rothschild. Child. What's their name by birth? Bauer. They're Germans. Nazis. Man, I think you kind of, we got the unlocked in the key thing. The keyhole has a key in it. It was turned and the door was open and it's all Khazars. Synagogue of Satan. It's in the Bible. My God. Again. Yep, the Bible's right again. Jeez. Always is. One thing after another. I'm sorry, Krista. Bless your heart. A big step, though, Rebecca, step one is ending the Fed. And we put the power of creation of currency and setting of rates and all that stuff, we give it back to the Congress. Now we got a bunch of fucking morons in the Congress, so go figure with that one. But that's where it should be. And then the Treasury prints. That's how it's supposed to work. Now what you base the value of the currency on is entirely the purview of society. I'm not, I'm not a one-size-fits-all type of person. I'm going to tell you exactly how you do everything, okay? Because this is a big, it's a question for society as a whole of what you think the best thing that you could base your, your bottom line currency on. It used to be gold standard, of course, but we got no gold no more. It's gone. There's nothing in Fort Knox. They took it. What's up, Cherished? God bless you, Cherish. We love you. If you got if you got a couple coins to pop in in the in the drawer in in the piggy bank for us, God bless you because we we need just a little bit. The gas has gone down. Uh, it's like three seventy. Oh my God! I'm saying it's gone down and it's like thirty cents away from four dollars a gallon. But it had it used to be three eighty five, three ninety for fucking regular unleaded. Are you? The Biden economy is zero. It's it's a zero. Okay, Joe, whoa, look at all the Democrats did, these bills they put forth. What, the, the Inflation Reduction Act? What has that done exactly? People are still suffering horribly. What's up, Matt? Wait, they, they passed the Inflation Reduction Act and prices went down for like two days. And they were back to what they were. You got gas down to 370 right now. Why? Because Joe released more street strategic reserve. This is games, and they've always done this to us. Every time, every four years, they play these games. The economy's awesome. Everything's going great. Here's lower gas prices by putting out our reserves. Moron, you're supposed to save that in times of, for times of crisis. It's 280 there. Krista, yeah, well, that's, I mean, that ain't bad at all. It's probably going to get better as, as closer we get to November. It's Biden and administration going, oh, please put us in again. Sure. You're a good choice, right, Joe, when he's standing out in the middle of nowhere talking to the air. Did you see that video of him? At, I guess it was the D-Day thing with Macron and stuff. I guess that's what it was. They were on the beach, I think, Normandy Beach probably. And Biden's like talking to nothing. He's standing there talking to nothing. What's up, Donnie? How you doing, man? I'm going to get this that thing together with, with looking into the job. If you got something to put in the till... Anything you can would be awesome, like 10 bucks, anything. Just because I'm, I'm trying to save money for gas mainly. That's my main concern. Because if I don't got gas in that, I can't go respond to some job shit or whatever. So I'm just always trying to keep gas in the fucking car, you know. Praise Jesus that I have such a kind family member to help me in the way he has, you know. But I, it, if you get a little bit of help, if you can, it's cool. God bless you, Donnie. You know, what a crazy fucking world, Donnie. How are you going to vote, Donnie? Maybe I'll just vote how you vote because you're a good dude. You know, 
you're good folks. You you fucking talk the shit. You do the you you doing a life. You got a good job. You're doing it, man. You know. What a world, man. We got a genocide that goes on and on and on and on. And I rebuke myself for not knowing this sooner about what they were doing in Gaza. I, I Because Hassanabi, I'm looking back at Hassanabi's videos. He was talking about the, yeah, pray for peace. That's all you can do. All right, Cherish, what do you think? Trump's the only answer. I'd rather be grabbed by the pussy than have an economy that we have now. I never cared about Clinton getting blowjobs, and I don't care about uh, or sh or Shio shut. I care about America. I don't know what that last thing was. Yeah, and cherished a lot of people feel the same. A hundred percent. I hold my, I held my nose. I I was a pretty holy living Christian dude. And if I, if I listen to that video again and again of Trump going grab him by the pussy, I might not have voted for him in 2016, you know, against Hillary. Oh, it's personal. Okay. I don't care about personal stuff. Yeah, it, I hear you. And that's, that's basically how I stomached voting for him was say, look, Hillary Clinton, absolutely not. She's a fucking murderer. She wants us to be at war with Russia because they got this fucking fetish about Russia. Brzezinski and her crew, they're psychotic when it comes to Russia. They want war bad. So I will vote for Donald Trump over Hillary Clinton. And yes, I'll wear the MAGA hat. I'll wear the fucking MAGA shirt. I did. I fully supported him. Crooked Hillary, exactly. See? You guys get it. You guys totally get it. Your hands hurting? Yeah, your hands are all swollen. Look like fucking small eggs around your thing. Yeah. You're very puffy and swollen. Yeah, if I had just like 13 bucks for some of this, uh, you know, for certain things, to get inflammation up. Are you thinking of voting this time around? No, I ain't, Chubby. I can't. I just can't. I carry my voter IDs in my purse. Yep, I'll be voting Trump. Yeah, go for it, Cherish. I, I, I support your right to do that completely. Me? I'm not going to vote for a guy that shits his pants in front. Well, they both shit their pants. Oh, okay. Donnie, my man. Donnie, Donnie. Bro, you're just insanely blessed. I I don't need to bless you because you're blessed, dude. Like, you're really smart and chill, too. That's like a real... Vote, run for something, Donnie. Dude, yeah, absolutely. We're bringing Donnie on for a second. I mean, you're probably going to crash the phone. This shit to work. You're on the fence, Chubby. How does this work? Let me click that. God bless, brother. God bless. Hey, dude. I don't even know what. I can't see you, so I just hear you. What's That's up, That's fine. Dude? How you doing, buddy? Uh, you're a blessing, bro, oh. and I just appreciate it you. Comes, like, it comes back tenfold, brother. You know what amen. I mean? Amen. 100%. Yes. We pray for this. <laughs> that for you all the time dude thank you brother i really appreciate Absolutely. you no i we appreciate you because it's people like you that help us survive man yeah it's, amen brother I, a, I, I, and i want the thing, to apologize i buy i've been i've been putting off clicking that fucking link for where where you gave on. me that link click I on am. it right i am i just i've been so preoccupied psychologically with other bullshit right. that Right. I need to focus on that. Uh, I have a hard time focusing. I'm on, uh, my doctor's got me on Adderall and all that stuff, but it, it kind of helps. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I got to end up taking more of it. So, yeah. yeah. I have a hard time. Adderall, I, I had a 
per I had a person uh, at my work that that gave me an Adderall once, and I tried it, and I was like, "Wow, I worked better that day than I ever did." It gets you focused, you know what I mean? Yeah. No. But other than that, what's going on? Is Shani okay, man? Oh man, man, she's wiped out today, man. The when the weather is like this, that the barometric pressure is like this, she's done. Like she can feel it in her bones. Yep. It's like literally, she said it's like had somebody has a like a crowbar underneath her knee and like. Bah. Damn, dude, she can feel it like every time it rains and shit, huh? Yep. It's it's one of those triggering things, and she has fibromyalgia on top of it. So sciatica? like sciatica problem or what? Do you have sciatica? No, you don't have sciatica. No. Um, but but she has osteoarthritis in her neck. Her back, her knees, like all that shit. It's fucking horrible, dude. It's horrible. So all you, all you could do is pray. I keep, I pray to Jesus every day that He heals her. You know. Give me a rap. Do the thing. What? Do that. Do the what? Cross. Oh, you don't this, notice you do that? Thank you, thank you. That's all I needed. That's all you That's needed. That's all I needed. My <laughs> man. No, you're my brother, and seriously, somebody that has a giving heart on your level, like, he's going to bless it, so. Well, like I, I said, I mean, it, it, somebody's done that for me before. You know what I mean? Awesome. So, yeah, dude. Dude, I've been, I've yeah. been there, bro. I've been in that situation. You know I know have. Saying, so. when, it, when I had it, I was just giving and giving and giving and giving that's everything. That's the way I am. I'm the yeah. same way you are, and that's dude. why I help you. So fuck all the haters. Dude, well, you're bitch, the man. Well, bitches anyway. Seriously, you're if awesome, they need Donnie. A job, tell them to hire, you know, I'll hire them for a job, but that's about it. Fucking hate Yeah, them. I mean, they like to, they love to freaking criticize, but I, I proved that I, yeah, I'll go to a job. I went to that trash job at Burger King that was fucking, I wasn't getting paid nothing. Like, right. At least but you I were did. trying, yeah. you know. I, I was mean, trying. Murder King yeah. sucks, though. They're fucking political, and if you fucking say the wrong thing, they'll fire you. And they got to yeah, keep their is... funding coming in. Yeah, it's not only that, dude, but that, like, so you're you're working with young kids. Right. And, like, there was this one girl there that was, like, she she had this thing for guys. I, I think she was flirting with every fucking guy in there. Right. And, and the one guy that was there before me, she got the fucking guy fired because she said, oh, he was, like, rubbing up to me or something. That's all but she did the same fucking thing. She did the five fucking same thing to me. Right. And the, managers, the manager goes to me. He's like, well, you got to be careful how you talk to females here. I said, I literally said, hi, my name is Jason. Nice to meet you because it was the first time I worked with her. And she took offense. That's fucking What the fuck are you doing? What, like, what's your it's, deal? It's like you're in customer service relations, girl. You need to be, you need to uh, be used to that or have tougher skin or whatever. You know what I mean? So well, yeah, it's ridiculous. It's just fucking stupid. But it's like if you're working with kids, it can be like that, though, man. They're, yeah, true. I don't know. True. Certain ages, I don't think mix very fucking well. So yeah, that's true. Whatever, man. You, you can't, you know, go in there and work with some high school student because she ain't gonna fucking have the life experience. You know what I'm saying? I I don't know, man. It, it's just weird vibes. You get weird vibes from certain people. It, I I the rest of them, I didn't have a problem with any of the rest of them. They were fine, but that one chick that they 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 chucked her out. They they fucking put her in a different store because she kept doing this to dudes. Right. Hey, buddy. Cat. Like, I don't know I what, what the fuck that is. It's like, what? Just because you like you like crushing on me or something, you're going to want to get me thrown out of this fucking job? That's what it was, like, what, dude. What? It's because you had a girlfriend and she was jealous. What is that, dude? Like, it's Jesus. Just it's just women, bro. They they don't like other women, bro. They want to, they don't like no. you. Mm hmm think. To be honest, I mean, I don't know what it is. Because I just wear, I wore, I just wore my ring out all the time to make people know. And like, the, like she just don't got, hit on me. She got resentments. I mean, I mean, <laughs> she got resentments. Yeah. yeah. 
I, that's seriously what it is. And, the, and yeah. she was doing it with other, it's not just me. That's the thing. It wasn't just me. It was other dudes. So there you go. It's exactly. like, yeah, fucking fire the person. Don't transfer them, fire them. That's like transferring a pedophile priest. Don't transfer them, fire them. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, dude. Look, they just send them somewhere else. That's like so stupid. Yeah, yeah. She's just gonna do it to some other dude. Yeah, period, dude. That's like, exactly what the fuck? What gonna do, bro? Whatever. Whatever. I don't know. I, this is why I just like I want to have a job like you, Donnie. You're at your, you got, you got it. You're in your house. You're doing your deal. You know. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I have a few different offices. I got some in Georgia. Uh, Ohio. <clears throat> I got workers all over the country, dude. You just work remote. I mean, Landstar, right here, you know, they're huge. They're a multi billion dollar. So basically, I have the ability, I have the cap I have the semis. When you're driving down the road, I can fill those up. So you need to find something that you can facilitate to make money. So we could just wholesale product. We could start a product, we, you know, filling up grocery store, anything, dude. dude we that's could use the yeah. trucks to our benefit. You feel me? That's really interesting. It's like it's like taking advantage of supply chain stuff. Exactly. And I shipped to Mexico. You know, I got okay. semis going from J.A. Malisco to Lisco, Mexico, all the way to New York City, dude. So that's what I can bring right. to the table. Semis going straight up to the other side of the country. That's freaking awesome. Well, it's I just want cool. everybody it's to... It's kind of cool, bro. You know what I mean? Dude. I mean, what, I... 23... 2,303,000. And I have, what, seven of these? Every year. This is 2023. They didn't send 24 yet, but... Wow. Yeah. Here's 20, 20, and then 21. I did 4,160. Dude, what? So, Dude, Donnie, you, you, you realize? You bro, I'm, it, bro, I'm on. I am with Check you, Donnie. Right oh. out. Take a look at it. Get yeah. people to uh, go to the website if they can send if they need a question or a quote send them to the website nice. it'll go right to my uh, email and i'll forward it to you so you know which emails are yours and i'll pay you off of the commission off of every load dude, dude that that's yeah. insane all right well i'm i'm gonna be clicking on that donnie i think i'm gonna jump off of here for a little bit because right. you you guys you and shani have a good night i'm gonna keep watching you though all How's right. Doing? Yeah. How do I I'll probably out? be back on. How do I go ahead, bro? Yeah. Sorry. How do Fucking I? Delay. What do I push? The X? I'm sorry. What do I do? I'm Hit sorry. The X? Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. I'll be back later on. All, all right? right. Bro, later. Thank you again, Donnie. Love you, bro. Later. Peace and Maranatha.